One in 50 people are walking around with a brain aneurysm, and that aneurysm may cause that person no problem, but 30,000 people a year rupture. There is still so much to be done for this disease. We're the benefiting charity tonight at the Boston Bruins game. They want to support. Oh, thank you. This thank is a beautiful you. foundation. The product's over 21,000. I'm a geriatrician, internist, and it taught me a whole bunch of stuff I didn't know. We're all going to get through this together, apart. But we have to continue to focus on our fight against brain aneurysms, a very treatable disease. The Brain Aneurysm Foundation continues to function. A lot of activity is going virtual. We're available if you have any questions or are there are any issues that we can help you with. We are doing our best with online support groups and webinars. People have been talking about the importance of mindfulness and meditation during this COVID-19 crisis. And I think about how important those tools were for me in my recovery after brain surgery. We would have been here with maybe close to a thousand people, but due to COVID, most of our events this year had to go virtual. Right about now, we would have been landing as a team on this beach. Today I'm coming at you from, well, my basement. I am usually up on a podium at Jones Beach in front of 1,500 people, but although it's virtual, we still need your support. I lost my mother in July 2014 to a brain aneurysm. It is in her memory that motivates me to do my part in tackling this disease. For all the 150s out there, help me stop the pot. I survived a 10 millimeter brain aneurysm that ruptured post-surgery. They said I had heat exhaustion and was drunk. They said it was stress. For my second, they said it was impossible because I was still recovering. when all elective procedures really have been shut down. We are still caring for patients with symptomatic brain aneurysms, research into brain aneurysm treatment. Though we cannot be together in person, in total the BAF is awarding 375,000 in grants to advance the science of brain aneurysm care. Congratulations to the following recipients. Please join me in the Global Brain Aneurysm Challenge to raise $500,000 by the end of 2020. The Brain Aneurysm Foundation has been there for our family and others that have experienced this tragic disease. They spread awareness, they support survivors, and they support people like myself who've lost loved ones. It has allowed us to educate ourselves and the community around us on brain aneurysms. The Brain Aneurysm Foundation has been such a blessing from the beginning when I was first diagnosed having a 31 millimeter giant fusiform aneurysm. If it weren't for the foundation, I would not be healing as quickly and we're not as successful in life. The connections and the extended family that we have gained means the world to us. They have really led the way uh, in terms of patient advocacy, patient support groups, and support for brain aneurysm research. Thank you to the Brain Aneurysm Foundation for all that you do. Thank you.
Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Join the challenge. Be the change.